Hello my lovelies, welcome back to another Making a Journal. Uh, this is series two, and I'm not quite sure what part this is. You'll find out when I put it up in the video, I suppose. Now, I was watching somebody make her own film strips. She had a die, and I thought that was absolutely gorgeous. And I thought, I wonder if I could do that using just little circles along the side. And then I discovered I had a film strip stamp. So I thought, okay, let's do that in my journal. So I've done three. I've just stamped it out in, I think it's sepia brown, I think, I'm not sure. And I've put a little piece of brown paper, a little piece of collaged paper, and then some stickers. And it just finishes off that page really, really well. And I found, as I was going through, just checking out what I've yet to do, and there's not much left. There's lots of pages to write on but not a lot of stuff left to do. I found two more strips, so I thought today you and I could do that together. Now let's get something solid underneath that, because this book is getting a little bit lumpy and bumpy. Now, is that going to be yeah, too fat? Yeah. Okay, let's leave it lumpy and bumpy. Okay, so I've got my brown paper bag. I'll put a little bit in there. And I'm only going to put just a little bit of glue. I'm not going to cover the whole piece. It doesn't matter if it's a little bit loose in this, because it's all going to stick. Okay. So you could always put twinches in there, or not twinches, but inches, little inch pieces of paper in there, and make your own little film, which I think I might do later on. Not necessarily in this journal, but in another one. And where did that come from? Go over there, you. Okay. This might only be a little short video today. I've got to set my timer. There we go. Just in case I get to the 20 minutes, we'd better have the little timer set. And what else have I got? Oh, I've got some... I had a very large piece of... Where's that guy? I was going to show you, but I can't find it now. No, I can't find it. It's lost in the Munster table. But it was quite a large piece of barcode. So I've torn a little piece of that off. And each one has to be, get progressively smaller. does look tatty hanging off like that. I'm going to put some more glue on that paper. I don't like it. I was going to get slap dash and slap happy, but I don't like that. So I'm going to put that on there, and I'm going to lift that up. Hopefully not tearing it. Oh, it did stick. Okay. But I want some more glue on it. Not happy, Jan. Oh, I'm sorry if there's any Jans watching. It comes from an old Australian TV advertisement where a lady was supposed to put something into the Yellow Pages phone directory and didn't. And her boss was screaming at her from the top story of the building, Not happy, Jan! And poor Jan was running a mile because she knew she was in trouble. So any time we do something that we're not content with, <laughs> some of us, not all of us, now this is a piece of a postage stamp that I've torn into three. I didn't need three, but I just thought I need something a little narrower, so I've torn it. But yeah, any time we, we do something we're not content with, we sort of, some of us will say, oh, not happy, Jan. It's amazing how little things like that stick, isn't it? put that a little bit below everything else because otherwise the the barcode is going to get covered up. A little bit of glue. I think I might use the other straight edge on the other one as well. I rather like that. Now I'm just thinking what else I can put on top of this 
to make it a little feature. There's lots of glue there. I'm not going to stick my finger in that. I am the master of sticky fingers when it comes to doing collage. I get, you know, bits of glue all over myself. It's amazing. Okay, now to find something that's pretty. I could put some dots. They don't match this though. Doesn't matter. Where's my quick stick? Let's have a look at some dots. We'll put some on and you know, if we don't like them we can cover them up. See if we can get them off the blessed sheet. Okay, two for one. I'm gonna go so I'm gonna go with that. Get on there. Get on the blessed page, will you? Thank you. That looks kinda cool actually. I might put a third one on top of that one there to make it look like it's meant to be. Yep. Okay. I can work with that. Let's see if I can make another accident happen. Not quite the same shape, but hey, it's okay. Now to get that last one up, as well as the other two together. Yep, put that over the other side. Oh, that looks alright. I like it. I like this accidental stuff. It's good. Red light's still on my camera. That's good. I'll put two more over this side. I might even put a third one because it's best if you do things in three. It gives the eyes somewhere to rest, doesn't it? I do believe that's the, the reason for it. Two looks good, but three looks better. The uneven... Oh, that's not going to work this time. Or you get down there and stick onto other ones. Not quite that well. Get over. Oh, goodness me. When you're trying to do something on purpose, it doesn't always happen, does it? No, because that little one's hiding underneath. Ah! Oh, I'm just going to stick another one on top of him. So there'll be four, but you won't be able to see the fourth one because it's being hidden. That looks better. Okay, let's come down this side of the page. You can see how lumpy this journal is getting. It's gorgeous. So full of texture. Oh, heavens above. I'm not all fingers and thumbs, I'm all nothing today. It's just not happening. And these are so small a piece. And these are the centres of flowers that got left on there. Okay. No. Oh, come on, please. Do the right thing for me. Okay, I'm going to use one of these other two bits to add the third one so it's visible. I'm just about ready to give up on this little bit. It's bugging me to tears. Oh, I've only got one to go, so keep at it, Ruth. Just keep at it. I'll have to come back and press those down quite substantially in a minute. where that went because I don't I'll find it later when I'm tidying up my table oh goodness me I was watching Noreen from Crafty Organizer and she came up with a great idea of setting a timer for 15 minutes and doing one job in that 15 minute period. Oh gosh, it worked really, really well for me the other day, so I think I'm going to stick with that process. And anytime I want to do anything like tidy up my table, 
I'm going to set my timer for 15 minutes, and that one just really destroyed itself there. What you doing, Mr. Sticker? I might have to put some glue on the outside of those, and hopefully it'll go underneath. Because this tacky dr glue dries clear, I'm hoping that that will hold them down. Because they're so little, they're just going to spring off all over the place whenever I move the page. Okay, so I have to leave that like that now to dry. So I'm sorry, folks, that's going to be the end of it. Uh, what have I got left? Oh, 11 minutes, golly. Okay. Uh, there's not much more I can do for the minute except to let that dry. I don't want to put anything on there, or do I? Or do I? Question being, what can I put on there? What have I got in a bag? I've got this little bag here with tags that I made. I could put one of the tags there as a tuck spot, couldn't I? Yes, you could, Ruth. Yes, definitely. I like the look of this one. Oh, I like the look of that side even better. So I could put that there. Oh, that's going to add more bulk here, but if I put it there, I'm not going to be able to close my book. Uh, nope, I don't think that's going to work. Duh, nope, nope, nope. Okay, no, I'm afraid we're going to have to leave it there, folks. I'm sorry, this is a really, really short one. Oh, I, feel, I feel as though I've gypped you. Oh, that's not fair. What can I do? Quick think. Oh, I could put it over on this page, couldn't I? Yeah, that sounds like a good plan. Let's get some double-sided tape onto this baby. No, we don't want double-sided tape because that's not going to stick down permanently. We need to glue it. So that... We've got a tuck spot there, so I need to glue it down that way. Okay. That side. Gotcha. I pulled apart a little weed book. It was something that my husband um, delighted in collecting books of gardening and stuff, and there's not too many weeds in my garden at the moment that I can't identify. So I pulled this little book apart, and they're making the most wonderful little pictures. So you wouldn't think that that was a weed, would you? It's just a pretty little flower. And the same with that there. It's a weed, but it's so gorgeous. Okay, let's stick this down the right way. Okay, I'm just going to hold that there for a minute to let the glue sink into the page. Yada, 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 yada. Hooray, tally ho, and, and all those wonderful things that we say when we're waiting for something to happen, and we're not sure what we have to say, what we need to say, what we want to say. I hope it sticks. Yep, there's blue coming out there, that's good. Okay. That one too is going to have to wait for a minute. Okay, let's see what other little tags I've got in here. That one's got nice white on the background. Oh, that's the quilled one. That would make it too bulky. So, let us investigate the other two tags I have in this bag. She's a poet and she don't know it. Oh, no writing paper on the back. So, where is a scrap of paper? That will do nicely. And I'm not going to cover that lace up with paper. I'm going to leave that as a little feature. Okay. Double sided tape. On the very edge, and she's working black on black is not a good thing because you can't really see what you're doing. I must get my fawn mat out. It will make things a little easier to see.
fluke than I was going to say something really naughty. <laughs> More something rather than class. So I won't complete that. It was certainly not planned, that's for sure. I just fluked it. Oh yeah, that's cool. Alrighty. And a little bit of paper. And yes, I did just plonk it down because I know that I've got room over the other side to chop it off. And voila, we have a writing space as well as a pretty looking tag. a little bit fine there but that's okay too alright so there we go and we have another pretty page I like I like very much alright folks I'm definitely out of puff on this page so I'm going to shut the video down wish you all the very very best live life to the fullest and enjoy and I will catch up with you next time bye for now on the off switch. <laughs>